Hi everyone, Basil Chapman in this 11 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update. Dow's down 76 at 36,081, 100 points off yesterday's all time high. Looking at this as maybe some kind of a pullback here in the Dow, there's a big divergence. You've got the SP pulling back from its all time high today in leg D, it went all the way to 4683, round number high, round number in an index at 46,000. Uh, 4683 that's amazing and it's trading at 4676 and just watch out it could be a little bit of a pullback here but it's the qqqs that are really amazing they're in leg c very strong at all-time highs of 397 61 up four and a half now what's going to be very important here is that the iwm also was very strong now it's pulling back a bit from an all-time high of 240.93 <clears throat> We'll see what happens over the coming few days because the market is ready for some kind of a digestive move, move. But you need bad news. And until the bad news really filters in and the market says, oh, oh, bad news, I don't like it, it'll ignore it. So that's what we're looking at. Gold is up huge, up 33 at 1797, just about to hit 1801, the 200-period moving average resistance, a very nice action here. The, <laughs> this is so interesting. The dollar is actually up strongly as well, up 46 cents at 94. This, I said a long time ago, look at all these different things as individual, they all separate. The dollar, VIXI, the volatility index, bondies, bonds, bonds are trying to rally and they are already struggling. They're in this lower range, but they are rallying a little bit today. And crude oil, look at this, crude oil is coming back after a big bounce early on and it's making, starting to, this is not good. I think crude oil is in a digestive phase. At least for the next week or two, we'll be watching this very closely. So I'm going to hand you over to Larry Preservante. There should be great programming all day. Uh, Larry is up. And then, of course, you get Think or Swim, Steve Rhodes, Dave White, Tom O'Brien. Have a wonderful day. And don't forget, uh, I've got the, the opening call, my daily newsletter. And you can check it out on the front page of TFNN. So we've got another few seconds to go. I just wanted to show you that the euro, EUR, USD, is trading sharply low. You remember the pattern we call the dreaded H? Lowercase h at 1.153. If at any point in the next three, four sessions, it closes under 1.52, that's a, not a good sign at all, and that should give strength to the dollar. But the dollar and gold going up together, very unusual. Think of all these different aspects as separate, separate entities. I think that's the best way to do it. Have a wonderful day. See you tomorrow at 8 o'clock. I'll be doing my show at 8 in the morning, recorded to play again at 10. Have a wonderful day, and I'll see you tomorrow.